My name is Kyle Bradley. I am the owner of American Outdoor Contracting Services. I am actually at the end of my second year in business. Um, I've got started uh, after I retired out of the military. It was just something I, I wanted to do, I've always wanted to do, is start into uh, lawn and landscaping. Um, and from there we've grown we've into fencing and now also doing more of the weed control and fertilization. The majority of it, I just like being outdoors. Uh, you know, being able to deal with people and, and the outdoors is it's my passion. As soon as I actually opened my business, uh, that was the first stop was to the Better Business Bureau to be accredited. My pride and joy is, is what we do, is how we do it, it's, it's the outcome, and, and just what we stand for. It's more than just me um, and random people that are employed by me because it's not, it's me and my family that, that actually own and, and operate the entire business. The Better Business Bureau just gives us the backing and the platform to stand on for people that can go to and trust them also be able to trust us. I was uh, in the United States Army. Uh, I joined in 1999. I was just tired of doing but I always did. At 18 years old, I was working in a grocery store. I wanted some direction in my life. I went into the Army as an electronics technician, also a paratrooper, so I jumped out of airplanes. Um, and I enjoyed all of that time there, just the camaraderie, meeting new people, uh, seeing different places, and just getting a more vibrant aspect on life from different points of view. Being prompt with time, um, knowing you know, what you've got to do next, where you've got to be, and, and just some of those organizational skills has, has been valuable. There's so many different platforms out there where people can leave you a review or whatever, but it's, it's the relationship and also communication back to us of events and different stuff. Absolutely, I'd recommend it. I think of a lot of reasons that it's, it's important for people to support veteran-owned businesses is, is just the simple fact that, you know, I could walk around and say, oh, I've always served the community and I'm still serving the community. Um, but you, you never truly know what veterans have gone through and, and their outlooks and, until you really talk to them. And that's if they're willing to, to be forthcoming with a lot of things they've seen. Everybody has different experiences in the military. Um, and, and some people, you know, where they are good at organizational skills and they can open up a business, you, you don't know what their limitations are and therefore they're doing something that they're able to do versus just something that somebody hired them to do.